Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, we're asked to explain in your own words what is meant by the equation the limit as x approaches 2 of f of x is equal to 5. And we're also asked, is it possible for this statement to be true and yet f of 2 is equal to 3? So what this limit means is that x is approaching 2, right? So if we're looking at the number line and we have 2, this means we're going as close as we possibly can to 2 from both sides. Right, so this would be 1.9, 1.99, 1.999, and so on, getting as close to 2 as possible, right? And the limit means we go, quote-unquote, infinitely towards 2 without ever actually reaching it. As we get closer and closer to 2, when we're plugging these values in to the function f of x, we're going to get a value that's approaching 5. Is it possible for this statement to be true and yet f of 2 equals 3? Yes, this limit doesn't actually say anything about the value of f at 2. It's only saying what happens when we're approaching 2, right? And so for most functions, right, where they're continuous, it doesn't really matter. So if we have this point right here, the value as we're approaching this point are approaching the value of the function at that point, as opposed to a function like this, the value of the function is way up here, but we're approaching this value down here. This is still a function. It might not look like many functions that you're used to, but just because the function is approaching a certain value at a point doesn't mean when you actually get to that point, it's going to be at the same value. So yes, it is possible for this statement to tr be true, and yet f of 2 equals 3.